now. This is one of the craziest pack of shoulder workouts I ever did. First, I started off with the one mile run. It's like my warm up. I ran one mile in a short time. It took me about six minutes to do it. And I'm ready now. As soon as I finished that, I went, I went over and did 30 pull ups. As less sets as possible. It took me about two sets to get 30 pull ups. As soon as I finished, as soon as I finished 30 pull ups, I went right into dips. I did 40 dips. We didn't have a dip, the dip thing at the other, um, the other gym was being used, so I used this one. Two barbells together. So I did 40 dips. As soon as I finished that, I did 50 inverted row. 50 reps of inverted row. Um, overhand grip. As soon as I finished that, I want to do 60, 60 push-ups in less sets as possible. And then once I finished that, I repeat everything again, ran another mile and did it again. So all together I ran three miles and did all the push-ups, pull-ups three times in a row before I even started my workout. That was like a workout in itself, but I use it as a warm-up just to try and challenge my body. Like I said, today I'm working back and shoulders. So all that just warms the back and shoulders up. And then from there, I went on to, I did a kind of like a big giant set going back and forth for four rounds. The first thing I did was wide grip, wide grip seated row. I did about 10 reps. And soon I finished that no break, grabbed some dumbbells, did standing shoulder press, palms facing away. I did about 10 reps. Then I went back to the seated row. Now I did wide grip the first one. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do um, narrow grip while shoulder width. I'm trying to squeeze that back each rep. Like I said, it's a crazy um, back and shoulders workout. I'm probably like, I'm always tired from doing the, the push-ups and pull-ups and all that stuff like that. I'm going back now and have palms facing each other, just hitting the shoulder from a different angle. As soon as I finish that, go back. Now I'm going reverse grip, seated row. I know this is all craziness, but this, I suggest you do this workout, workout like this every once in a while just to test your limits. I couldn't get that many reps on them. I am starting to get fatigued. Now I'm going to the on, kind of on press, twisting up at the top. Knock out as many reps as I can. Couldn't even get 10 reps. And I did a total of four rounds of that. All right, now I'm going to another giant set. This giant set gonna be strictly back. I did bent over row, not with too heavy, just 135. Knock out about 10 reps. As soon as I finish that, no break. Now I'm going to a low cable. I do like a low cable one on row. Just pulling, kind of twisting the arms a little bit. I right, getting that good stretch each time. Switch it to the group. About eight to ten reps on each side. And then back to the barbell row. So we're gonna like this, you build the muscle and you're doing a lot of cardio. I'm winding my heart rates up, doing reverse grip and bent over row. Couldn't even get that many. Now I'm going to straight arm, straight arm pull downs. My back is on fire now. And I did a total of four rounds of all of all four exercises. Then after that, now I'm going on to strip the giant set just strictly for shoulders. I did the bent over do bit bent over rows, then lateral raises. Then I did right here, then I did front raises. That's somebody else in the gym screaming crazy. Yeah, the front raises. Used, I used the plates just to hit it from a different angle. So now I'm gonna go upright row, push out, just the bar. Don't have to go too heavy. You can add weight if you want, but I didn't add any weight. I just did an upright row and push out just to smoke the shoulders out. Pussy. 
do your now I'm going back into a back tricep I'm going back to the lat pull downs I started from the back facing just pulling down wide, wide grip pull downs to the back then I turned around did it facing to the front I'm going to touch in the chest Touching the chest, squeezing the back. Still getting to get a full stretch, stretching the lats out. Then after I could do more reps, and then I changed my hand position again. Now I'm going reverse grip, same thing, just pull down. You definitely feel this in your lats. Now I'm going back to it. To a shoulder, um, shoulder, um, tricep. I did pipe push-ups, kind of like in a pipe position. Head down. So these push-ups are working the shoulders, or you could go ahead and do handstand push-ups. I chose to do that because I'm kind of tired towards the end. Then I'm gonna grab kind of a heavy set dumbbells. Gonna do some clean and press with the dumbbells. Do as many reps as I can. At this point, I'm not even counting reps. At this point, I'm just doing as many as I can. Then right here, I'm gonna do kind of like the battling ropes, but use dumbbells, kind of like a swinging motion. I did this uh, maybe time 30 reps right there, and that's the back, of, that's the back and shoulder workout right there. Give it a try, crazy workout, build a lot of muscle and a lot of cardio.